Yes, yes, yes. Good evening, everyone. And um, I want to especially welcome you to the day two of Turbo Charge Your Business. Um, it's a strategic session that helps you gain clarity and plan to get more results in your business in the next year. And I want to welcome you especially to today's episode. If you are new here or you missed the last episode, um, the video is on this um, is on this platform. I want you to go over the video and watch accordingly. Um, I want to believe you are going to, you know, be tremendously helped by the video. So this is Top of Charge of Business webinar once again. And um, I am your host, Shonde Abiola David, um, the CEO and the founder of TrackTech Integrated Solution. I am a serial entrepreneur and a digital strategy. So I will just... Um, um, I don't want to waste any much of your time today because um, we have quite a lot of things to um, cover up today. So I wouldn't want to waste much of your time. So I'll be moving over to some things um, that we need to discuss today so we'll be on the same page. So Yesterday was actually a very um, wonderful session. We had a great time together, you know, looking at um, how to use the power of um, the more framework to get um, more results for our business. We looked at that, and um, I'm sure that um, I will just go over some of the things that we discussed yesterday for the benefit of those that were not around so they can um, be adequately helped and we can be on the same page. So I'm trying to make sure this um, slide works. It's freezing and I don't know why it's freezing. So. I'm just going to open it once again so that, okay, so that we can be on the same page. So I don't know why it's not, um, it's not uh, playing. Just want to make sure that everything is working fine. So it's just a minute. I don't know why that is happening. It's just freezing. And um, so I'm, I'm just going to um, load it again to see if I'm missing out on something. Okay, I think it's now working. So, just like yesterday, I told us that I have a free gift for as many that will watch this video from day one to day two and day three. I have a free gift for you. And the free gift is that I will give you the, this webinar template, this webinar and material for you to use. You can model after this webinar to create your own webinar and um, of course, you can sell your product, you sell your services using this webinar model and make profit for yourself. So um, the, here's what you should do for me right now for you to get, you know, um, the full benefit of what I already have in stock for you today. I need you to pay 101% attention to everything I'll be sharing. Then I want you to grab a note and a pen to jot down some things, you know, 
the faintest ink is sharper than the sharpest brain. So, um, and I need you to excuse yourself from social media platform that is served as a description for the next few minutes of this um, webinar. Just like I said yesterday, I have a disclaimer to make. Um, I want you to know that I do not promise you, you know, great result or outstanding results because I don't know your level of preparedness. But what I know is that if you can apply everything I'll be sharing with you to your business, continue to ask questions, you continue to learn, I believe you are going to get an outstanding result. Um, also, I need you to know that hard work, commitment to excellence, and a can-do attitude is all that will make a difference. And for the past, for in these webinars, I'll be giving you some um, action plans for you to work on. So I want you to take the required action when necessary so that you will get the right result. So let's go. Let me just go over to what we discussed yesterday. Yesterday, we looked at how to use the power of the more framework to achieve 10 times result on your business goal. And I told you what the more framework is for. I told you that it's a growth analysis um, framework and the more stands for M, which stands for motivation, O stands for obstacles, R stands for resources, and E stands for execution. And under um, motivation, I spoke, I told you the fact that um, for you to have a meaningful transformation, there must be a motivation. There must be something that is driving you towards getting your, result, your re desired result in your business. So I told you that you should look for that motivation for the new year in order to achieve your business goal. I spoke about obstacles. I told you that obstacles are things that hold you back. There are some things that may hold you back from achieving your purpose, for, for gaining, you know, making your business to gain traction. There are some hindrances, some obstacles that needs to be taken away. You need to be able to identify them in the new year. I spoke about the resources, and I, say, I, I alluded to the fact that Every one of us have something to offer. It's just that we take lightly some of the things that we have. So I ask you that look for people and uh, non-human resources that will be beneficial to you. You are just a contact away to that your breakthrough. I also spoke to the fact that that next year, you need to work on Need to execute, you need to learn how to execute your plan promptly. So today we will continue from there by looking at my five content creation strategy to get unlimited traffic, leads, and referral to your business in the new year. Five content creation strategies for unlimited traffic, leads, and referral to your business. In the new year, I want to believe somebody is supercharged to receive something this night. And I'm going to be a little bit practical. I'm going to bring in my own personal experience to bear here so that you can implement and work on these things in your business for the new year. So let's just go over to the first strategy you can use. The first strategy is storytelling. Um, I, I cannot overemphasize the power of telling stories. Stories sell. Stories sell. My dear fellow entrepreneur, my dear fellow business owner, you will be doing yourself a great help by learning how to write compelling stories, believable stories that sell. Stories sell because of its virality. You know, stories go viral. You know, stories train. So being able to write compelling and engaging stories that is in sync with your brand is an edge you have over your contemporaries. 
just let me picture, let me print a picture to you on your Facebook um, walls. Compare the time you write a little story, you write a story of something that happened to you and just a random, you know, content that you share. Which of the content performed better? I tell you the story will perform better than just the generic you know, writing we, you know, based on our words. So, story sell. So, story do not have to be about you. It doesn't have to be about you alone. But I believe you have, you have, every day you have something to tell. You have a story to tell. You have something that happens to you every day that can be a source of inspiration, a source of motivation, and a reason for others to engage with you. So, you have something to share with people. It could also be about other people. You can write a story about other people or other brands. You know, it could be a trending issue. This one sells fast. It could be a trending issue just creatively and with wisdom. Craft a story around that trending issue and you will see people engaging with your, um, with you on your platform. However, the idea is that you must be a clever weaver to weave stories that speaks. You must be a clever weaver. You know a weaver, somebody that weaves um, hair for people, somebody that weaves basket. It has to do with what, you know, clever, being clever. So you need to weave your stories in such a way that it will speak, it will advocate, it, it, it educates. And it entertains your follower. Your story should speak to them. Your story should advocate, should stand for something. Your story should educate. You can write a story to educate some people. You, um, you, your, your followers, you can write a story also to entertain. You know, you, you'll see how fast the story will spread. You know, people want to share it and it will drive unlimited traffic to your business page. It works. Look at the big guys, the social media influencers online, the Emekanobis of this world, the, 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 the Emmanuel Akwe of this world, the Amanda Chisholm of this world, the Oland, Oluwanish Ola Kedjus, you know, the Le Faruti Mees, you know, these people, they write stories, they use trending issues, you know, to compel, you know, their followers to engage with their content. So while writing story, I need to put this as a note of caution to you. Be wary of gossips. Yes. Ensure that you are not in for chasing clouds. And um, ensure anything that will bring a negative PR to your business. While I can't teach you how to write stories, I believe... Um, there are 1,001 videos on YouTube that can teach you the basics of writing stories. Your stories might not necessarily be grammatically correct, but it is the lesson in that story that will compel people to engage with you and do business with your brand. That is the number one strategy. Number two strategy is you should leverage videos. Use videos for every of your content creation strategy in the new year. Yes, it only take four seconds to catch people's attention. It has been proven in marketing that a person just need just four seconds to, you know, for their cash and their attention to be caught. If you are unable to do that in that four seconds, then the attention span will elapse and they will, you know, be um, 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 attracted by another thing that catches their fancy. One of the best ways to make people notice you and to have an, a, a remarkable impression on you is through videos. Yes, videos work. Creating videos it works like magic. So appearing on screen and speaking as well is a big deal to many.
a lot of people, a lot of business owners, they will tell you, I'm too busy with my business. I can't be standing in front of a screen or in form of camera, you know, to create um, a video. Well, I need to tell you that your uniqueness is in the fact that you are showing up. People are seeing your face. People can relate with you. People can feel you. They can feel your heartbeat. They can feel your gesticulation. They see you speak. They hear you. Your intonation, everything about you speaks. So they connect with you. They bond with you with videos. You and your team should invest in the right knowledge on video production. Yes, it doesn't have to be expensive. A good phone, a lightning system, just like what I am having in front of me, a audio device, you know, that works, that enhances your video, your audio production, and a video editing tool, even on your phone, you have some video editing tools that works like magic. There are great ways to start creating video, but you need to have that confidence in yourself that, that yes, I want to stand in front of a camera to create videos that really works. So you could start a video series. Personally, when I started out with videos, I started with a video series. You know, I offer tips and tricks on making money online and some other things like that that pertains to my business. I give ads, I give solutions to people's problems, major problems that people encounter in my niche. I offer solutions to them. And almost uh, every time, every now and then, I've had people come to my WhatsApp to ask questions about the videos I have created in the last two, three years. Some of these videos still works for me. So be there for your fans. And I need to also say this, that you should also maximize what we call the short videos or the reels. We call them short and reels. These are 30 seconds, one minute video, short videos that, you know, attends to a particular problem that gives solution to a particular problem. Then also, don't forget to maximize platforms like TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook um, Live to share your content. In fact, there was a video I created, I edited. It wasn't really my video. It was a video of someone, and I feel that my followers would need it. And um, it grew my TikTok account from barely 120 people, followers to over 7,300 followers in a month. And that is the power of leveraging on videos. So even if you don't know how to appear on screen, um, you can start with other people's video, but ensure that you give them credit or else um, you may, your videos may be flagged on this um, social media platform and um, you may be penalized for it. So, Ensure that video creation is one thing you will take serious in that new year. Now, the third one is I want you to adopt a winning strat webinar strategy. Yes, webinars. Webinars work when you have expertise in a skill set and you are looking at attracting quality people to learn from you. I tell you from my heart of heart, I use webinar a, a lot. In fact, this webinar is one way of, you know, giving out the little I know about stuff in my industry to people. And with that, I am influencing people. And, uh, and I am attracting quality people to learn from me. It's also about your, it's also your sure bet. If you are launching a new product or you are working as an affiliate, all you need is a desire to help other people. You need a desire. You, are, you need to have a desire to help other people when you want to start creating webinars for people. You need a product. You, sh you should have a product you are promoting. You know, that product should be able to solve a problem, a major problem that people are having. So then you should, you should have a good webinar script targeted at selling. You see this, my webinar script that I will made available to you after this three days um, strategic session, you will be, you, if you are wise enough, you can model this webinar to create your own webinar and to set out any product, whether 
It's an affiliate product. Of the, it's a product that you have created yourself. Then you also need a webinar hosting platform. Um, now I'm using Telegram. You can use Zoom. You can use WhatsApp. You can use even your close Facebook um, live stream. You can also get a third party. You can get third party apps like Re, um, Restream.io. You can also use them. Um, um, I've forgotten the name of this. Um, um, Livestream.io. You can also use this platform, this third party platform, you know, to host your um, webinar. You can also host it on WhatsApp. You can do WhatsApp videos, you know, just to teach people, solve a problem, a particular problem for people. And while solving that problem, you are selling a product that will give them the ultimate benefit, you know, of a sure banker solution to that problem. So you are selling it out to them while they engage with your webinar. See, it works like magic. It's just that it will take you time for you to prepare your webinar script. It will take you, you know, you spend a little money to you know, promote your webinar. And if you already have a follower online, you can just create a webinar series. You can make it per month. I even have a friend that does webinar almost every, he does it every week, every Wednesday is his webinar day. So, and for that Wednesday, he has a product he is selling. He also uses it also to sell other people's products. So you can also use this winning webinar strategy to, you know, increase attract and um, sell more in that new year. Here's one webinar. You can see the screenshots. So you can see it here. This webinar, I created it to, in year 2022. And um, I have used this webinar to sell my affiliate, one of my affiliate products. It is a car tracking business. I have used it to sell it. And it's just a 45 minutes webinar. And even till today, people still ask me questions. People still come to my WhatsApp, you know, to ask questions on how can they do this? How can they start this business? And you can, as you can see it, as at the time of recording this video, it is over 2,500 um, views on YouTube. So YouTube can start using webinars, you know, to sell out your business in that coming year. So number four, use AI-generated content. I know some people, they have reservations concerning AI, but I am an AI enthusiast, and I'm an AI, I'm a, gener AI, a generative AI specialist. I know what I'm saying. AI is a lifesaver to many content creators who know how to find their way around it creatively. See, it's AI skill being able to use ai is one skill that you should learn and it starts for ai for ai tools in order to increase your productivity from time to time on my page recently i started creating images via ai i started using ai to generate images you know i use funny prompts you know funny ai I just think about it there was a day i thought about um, I wrote a prompt that create an image of a boy, um, a, 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 a um, fowl, you know, pursuing a boy. You see the prompt. I will show you after this slide. You see the 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 the, the, the image that was generated. You know, I just say, I just gave the my AI tool to create for me. And if you see it, if you go on my page, the the I have close to fifteen comments and over twenty likes on that page, on that um, content alone. So I even have once used AI to write thread on my X platform, on my uh, a thread on my X platform, and it generated for me, you know, impression. It generated, you know, um, you know, a lot of people liked it. A lot of people also followed me as a result of that thread I used, I created and it was 101% AI generated. So you don't know, let me tell you the secret and the benefit of using AI is that 
once you are able to write prompts for your AI, it triggers engagement and it goes viral. It has a higher chance of virality. Even it has more chance of virality than your normal photos, your normal image. Because there's a way the Facebook or the YouTube, um, X or LinkedIn or whatever platform, the algorithm, there's a way the algorithm, you know, um, is being triggered by this AI-generated content so that they want more people to see it. So you can create AI-generated text, AI-generated images, and even AI-generated videos if you can find your way around all this. That is number four. I started by saying that you should start with storytelling. We also looked at the power of, level, of creating videos. We also looked at, you know, adopting a winning webinar strategy. We have also, we are now looking at the, you know, adopting AI generated content. So look at the, um, all these images that you can see here, 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 here. They were generated, you know, by me just writing a simple AI prompt for my AI tool. And here is what, these are not, you know, these are AI generated images. They are not real images. They are AI generated. And I tell you, they are, they are, you know, in a source of engagement for my platform. And some of these AI images, I have even, you know, curated some of them to create reels, short reels that has increased, you know, my, um, my visibility online. So please, you can also, you know, adopt this AI um, content to spice up your content creation in the new year. So lastly, I'll be speaking on expertise strategy. Expertise strategy. It's just like the webinar strategy. But in this case, you are not necessarily creating a video, but you are creating a text-based content to solve a problem. You are strategically and intentionally creating a test-based problem, a test-based content to solve a problem. You are positioning yourself as an authority in your field, and um, you are making use of what we, we uh, platforms, uh, uh, you are making your use of question and answer-based platforms like Quora, Reddit, LinkedIn, and Facebook groups. The truth of the matter is that on this platform, people ask questions. So you are you know, intentionally creating, you know, answers to the questions. And by that, people want to follow you. People want to learn more from you. And if you have a product you are selling or a service you are selling, they will want to buy from you because you have already, you know, used your expertise to help them in your own little way. When you are there for people, when they, they need help, they will also go all out for you when you need them. So in all of these strategies that I've you know, highlighted, make sure you strike a balance of not becoming a father Christmas. Ensure that you are not just giving all to your people, to your followers. You are just giving, giving, giving. No. Ensure that from time to time, I'm not saying you should now be salesy. No. Ensure that from time to time, you have an offer you are promoting that you want these people to buy. You have an offer that you want them to test run, you want them to use to better to get better results in whatever they in whatever issues they are having. Ensure that you are crafting offers from time to time in your business. Although it depends on the type of business you do, it depends on the services you are rendering to people, but ensure that you are not just giving and giving and giving, uh, but you also have an offer that you want them to also, you know, buy into and benefit from. So lastly, be authentic and be true to yourself. Be authentic and be true to yourself. You don't need to fake anything. You don't need to do, um, you don't need to um, sugarcoat people. Be true. Be real to yourself. Let people know you for who you are. I am real. I don't need to form to you. I don't need to tell you what I have not achieved. I am who I am, and I want you to be 
who you want to be that year without being fake. So, yes, our next team, which will end tomorrow, is I want to show you the secret of paid ads. What paid ads can do for you in that new year. How you can use paid ads to get better results in the shortest possible time. So, and also that in tomorrow, uh, on the next part, in the last part of this webinar, I'll be giving you a, my gift and also presenting you a powerful offer. Something that I know will help you in your journey for that next year. I want to believe you. It will be a gift that you will not want to resist. Yes. So that's why I need you to pay attention to what I'll be sharing with you tomorrow. So having done all today, today has been a very great one. So if you watch this video to the end, in the comment section, I want you to tell me which of these strategies you have been using before. How has it been beneficial to you? And tell me which of these strategies I have shared, this content creation strategy that I have shared with you, which of them will you be adopting in your business for the next year? I want to hear from you. Use the comment section or in the WhatsApp or Telegram group. Drop something for me. Drop something for other members of the group. Let's engage. Let's discuss about it. And let's see our business grow together in that next year. Remember, today I told you about the five content creation strategy that drive traffic, that incre increases engagement, that makes more sales for you, and which you should adopt for the new year. I started by telling you that storytelling is your one best shot. The second is that you should look for a way of leveraging on videos. I told you about, you know, adopting a winning webinar strategy. I also told about using, talked about using AI-generated content. And lastly, I spoke about what? You know, adopting what your expertise strategy. I want to believe it has been a swell time sharing with you tonight. And um, I hope to see you tomorrow. I need this video to go viral. I need more people to join me even in this webinar or in this video, please feel free to share the link to this group with people so that they will benefit everything that I've shared with you tonight. Thank you so much for joining me. The WhatsApp platform or the Telegram platform is here for you to use. If you have any question, you have anything you want to talk about, please use those platforms. So I will see you tomorrow. Till then, remain positive. I remain Shonde Abiola Damilari Onkwalikama, and I am your faithful partner in your business progress. Bye for now.